In this video we are going to look at how to draw geology into a cross section. We already have the cross section open and zoomed to the extent that we want to use it. You can see the full cross section here. So the first thing that we need to do is have a look at the rock codes that are available. You can see what these are by um, clicking on the library tab in the left hand panel and um, these are all the rock codes that are available within this session. We can add new ones but this tutorial doesn't cover that. We can always click, also click on this button here and that will bring up a new window showing us the codes as well. So we need to select the code that we would like to draw a line for and that's going to be made ground. We also need to make sure that the geology layer is active that is automatically added to all cross sections. That gives us a floating palette with two tools, the polyline and the pen tool. To start with, we're going to use the polyline tool. So we select that and make sure that we've got the right rock code selected. And we have to click for every node that we want to add. So a single click to add a node, roughly following the boreholes and double click to end. We just need to adjust that first node slightly in order to make the um, unit colour up correctly. Now for the second rock unit we're going to add, we'll use the other pen tool so that I can demonstrate the use of both of them. So that is, so we're going to select the limestone and we're going to select the pen tool. And that is just a click and drag. So you hold the left hand mouse button down and you drag the line where you want it to be across the screen. Okay, so we turn that off again, that tool. So we can edit these lines if there's anything that's not quite right. So if we click on the line to activate it, you'll see that the nodes turn green. We can then, um, for instance, add a node by double clicking on it. We can move a node by dragging it and we can delete a node by double clicking on it.